Hello all, today in this video, I am going to provide details regarding a multidisciplinary engineering journal which is indexed in Scopus and also in some other indexing. So in this uh, the journal which I am going to provide details, I am just moving it from Scopus preview page. Since uh, uh, you may know while I am making this video, this journal is in Scopus, but if you are taking this video from other time means please check whether this journal is in Scopus at that particular time since you may know from Scopus the journals will be removed time to time. So now we can move to the journal which is advances in computer engineering software it is general engineering journal the subjects which is covered by this journal is general engineering and also computer science software related subjects and then it is initially known as advances in engineering softwares and workstations and the scopus coverage years is from 92 to present so the publisher is Elsevier, and uh, you can see the subject area and also the source type is journal so then we can move to the scopus content coverage to check how many articles this journal has published so far to check whether if a uh, the clone journals uh, so if you see some clone journals means it will be publishing many articles per month but when coming to standard journals it will work so if you are seeing the scopus content coverage means you can check whether it is a clone journal or not by that uh, this journal you can see whether it is cloned or not in 2023 it has published nearly 71 documents previous year that is in 2022 it has published nearly 157 documents so only less number of documents is published in this uh, journal so then we can move to the source home page of this journal so this is the source home page of this journal so it supports open access and then you can see the fields covered are mechanical aerospace uh, civil electro environmental engineering computer based engineering etc so the subdomains com uh, which is uh, uh, com this, this which this journal is covering is also given over here then we can check the time to first decision it is nearly 4.1 weeks and the review time is 5.3 weeks and you can also check the publication time which is 2.5 weeks and the acceptance rate is as high as 13% uh, so if you want to view all other insights means please check this link so then we can move to the articles and issues First of all, I'm just picking all issues to check how many art, uh, volumes this uh, journal is publishing in a particular year. Year in 2022, it has published nearly um, in every month. It is publishing uh, volumes, so you can see nearly 11 volumes in this journal. Uh, so, but uh, the uh, count is very less. You can see uh, once we are seeing in the Scopus preview page, we can see the count is very less. So, the last uh, journal which is in progress is uh, April 2022. So, now we can check the volume 177 and just uh, we can click um, article preview. So, I am moving to view PDF. So in something this uh, view PDF will be enabled but some papers it will not be enabled. So we can check with 2022 papers to view PDF. So I am moving to volume 173 and we can check some other papers, research articles. So I am just uh, clicking it and thus I am giving view PDF. So also I can't see. So why I'm seeing means in order to check the pro dates for uh, acceptance and uh, publication and all the gap. But here you can't see. So the gap we can't see. But uh, then we can move to the abstracting and indexing. Here already we saw it's indexed in Scopus. Apart from that, it is indexed in Web of Science. 
and some other indexing tool. Uh, so this is the details regarding this journal. So I'm just sharing the overview of this journal. So if you are interested in this journal means please check the link which we have shared in the description box. Thank you.